Your email sign-up forms play a crucial role in growing your email list, but just as important as your form's design or message is where you place that form on your website. It can be discouraging to see only a handful of subscribers after months of leaving a static sign-up form on your site. That's why in this video, I'll show you five of the highest converting places to put those forms to grow your email list. But first, if you haven't done so already, be sure to subscribe to our channel for more content like this. And don't miss the links I've left in the description. Now, let's get started. Nothing beats a nice warm welcome. And that goes for your website too. That's why a splash page, welcome gate, full screen welcome mat, full screen overlay, whatever you want to call it, is a great place to put your email opt-in form. And when you add personalization to customize your message based on the referral website source or your visitor's physical location, well, it just doesn't get much more welcoming than that. A full screen welcome mat grabs your visitor's attention the instant they land on your site, giving you the perfect opportunity to show a targeted offer or call to action. Putting an email signup form here has proven to increase conversion rates by as much as 80%. All right. Now let's move on to the next place to put your email signup forms. We've all been there. We've just finished a great book, movie, or TV series, and we're left wanting more. We remember that experience more positively and powerfully, and it's at that point we're most likely looking for what's next. Now, let's translate that experience to your website. Another great place to put your email signup form is at the bottom of your blog posts. That's because this is the moment when your visitor has just been enjoying your content and they are in the best mood for opting into your list. But don't just include an opt-in form at the bottom of your posts. You can also include opportunities to sign up within your posts. Seizing the moment when your readers are most engaged with your content. Better yet, take your most popular content and turn a mid-post opt-in form into a subscriber wall. Gating part of your content and providing an added incentive for your readers to subscribe to your email list. Just because you share your best content at no cost doesn't mean you have to give it away for free. Implementing a content logging script gives you an opportunity to segment your list and increase the quality of your list all at the same time, all without creating new content or lead magnets. For example, take a look at how Trading Strategy Guides added 11,000 subscribers with gated content. All right, let's move on to our next tip. For this one, we're going to stay right here on the blog post page, but really, you can apply this principle to any page where you've got engaging content. Instead of putting our email signup form at the bottom or even in the middle to gate our content, we're going to take a different approach, a polite approach. After all, politeness costs nothing and gains everything. Not that gating your content is rude by any means, but sometimes all you need is a bit of subtlety. So, for these situations, a slide-in campaign is the perfect go-to. Think of these as the polite version of a pop-up, appearing as the visitor scrolls down the page, displaying a highly visible sign-up form without obstructing the visitor's view of your content and without interrupting their natural flow and browsing experience. These campaigns simply wait patiently to collect the sign-up when your visitor is good and ready. And, Bonus points for digging into your analytics to find the average scroll depth for your pages and setting your display rules to show your campaign at that precise moment. Now, if you're a WordPress user and need some help figuring out the average scroll depth of your pages, you need Monster Insights. Monster Insights help you eliminate the guesswork and gives you useful information about your visitors right inside your WordPress dashboard. Okay, let's keep moving. Location, location, location. You hear it all the time from real estate agents, so let's take a page from their playbook. You have a prime piece of real estate on your website, the very top of your sidebar. This is the most common location for an email signup form, and visitors are used to finding one there, so you should make sure you have one there too. You don't necessarily even have to embed the form here either. You could simply add a link that opens the actual signup form, essentially turning this into a two step opt in. Either way, putting your signup form in the sidebar makes your signup form available across every blog post or page of your site. As a result, you could easily add hundreds of subscribers to your list each year. All right, that brings us to our last tip. But wait, one more thing before you go. See what I did there? 
you can do this on your website too. We all know that timing is everything and presenting the right offer at the critical moment when your visitor is about to leave your site gives you one final opportunity to turn them into a subscriber. You can use these exit intent campaigns on your shopping cart page as a two for one. They're perfect for growing your email list and reducing cart abandonment. By offering a small discount in exchange for signing up for your email list, both you and your visitor win. And this principle can be applied to any page, not just your shopping cart. Again, you can dig into your analytics to discover where your exit pages are and use exit intent campaigns to steer your visitor to your highest converting content. These campaign types are proven to work. Just check out this case study on how Crossrope used exit intent campaigns to grow their email list by 900%. Okay, so you might be thinking, this is all great, but I'm not sure how to implement these ideas. Well, what if I told you there's one tool that can do all of this and more? If you're serious about growing your email list, you need Optin Monster. Optin Monster offers more ways to reach your audience than any other lead generation tool on the market, helping you generate more subscribers, leads, and sales from the traffic you already have. All it takes is three simple steps. First, create a visually stunning offer, all without writing a single line of code. Second, target and personalize your offers with behavior automation. And third, test and adjust in real time. Optin Monster is both an easy to use WordPress plugin and a standalone SaaS product for other website building platforms. And Optin Monster integrates with all the major email service providers. I hope this video has given you some new ideas for strategically placing your email signup forms. For even more tips, be sure to check out the article I've linked to in the description. And as a thank you for sticking around to the end, I'd like to offer you a special discount on your purchase of Optin Monster. Just use the link and discount code I've provided in the description. Thanks for watching.